Hey guys, how y'all doing? I'm here to give you guys a recap on the new episode of Sakura Quest, which is on episode 18. Now, this episode right here was actually pretty cool, not too bad in a certain way, but we have to it that it eventually got into some nice, nice development of the events, but eventually ends up in a um natural disaster in a certain way. Not like bad disaster, but we'll have. But I think you guys might get an idea when I get there. We have to it that Yoshino's just playing the hostage and helping the elderly people out that's in the that's in the town. Even um let me see here. Um Makichan ends up coming over there and ends up getting drunk one time, which is very hilarious. And we have to it that they're still on the demand of making buses here and there to try like and make a coup or make a revolution. But we also see to it that the old man, of course, is like um Doing this so they can leave something behind in terms of using the internet and making YouTube vi making videos on the internet, etc. You know what I mean if you watch the episode. Pretty much they're leaving their legacy behind should their town be destroyed or should they pass on or be dead. And eventually um, the professor does explain this to Senai-chan and eventually she understands that. And we have to it that other people are helping each other out getting ready for the snow, etc. Which is really pretty cool in the village. And of course, like, um, Yoshino-chan ends up talking to the bus guy about if he's okay with everything after having a little small, like, intense talk with him. And he said he's not okay with it. And eventually we have to it that Sanai-chan and the bus guy ends up having a little small talk of what to do. And, it, and it's to make a Manoyama, like, um, bus, Manoyama on-demand bus, bus company kind of thing. But we also get to know that there's some kind of lantern lantern thing which I didn't which I do not know much about but it's like um let letting you know that this guy is safe but if it really turns out or blights out like if the fire is out on the lantern that they put in their house it means that they are in danger you have no idea and we also see to it that um that many others are like having a nice time with their life not too bad and aside from like um causing some trouble here and there that the old man did the professor he ends up making his final video an apology about what's to come, especially with the elderly people. But surprisingly, and in a very tragic way, that will be his last one. Because when he went to go grab some ice for his drink, he fell over suddenly. And I'm thinking in my mind, uh-oh, don't tell me this is happening. And he ends up dying. He actually died the moment uh, after a sudden expense, etc. And he ends up writing a will involving about, like, um... About demolition of a certain village of uh, property to the municipal government and do whatever you please with it. And we have to it that um, when the guy died, he actually left some will, the will about that, along with like some journals that Sanai Chan used. Not to mention like um, one of the treasures that the girls were looking for are is actually in the storage house of his, surprisingly. And we have to it that they're going to take advantage of this and next episode of course is like um getting ready for possibly another like um thing called the froggy folklore. So, we have to it that despite like some certain antagonistic intentions here and there, they actually like um, left a legacy behind, but at the same time the old man professor whatsoever ends up dying in a very bad process even though well he was 80 and above or something, so it's kind of natural in a certain way, and later that time, he ends up leaving a will behind, and of course giving the girls one of the treasures that they've been looking for for the Manoyama Festival, which was really pretty cool. So, not too bad of an episode, and it ended in a sad way, but I guess like um, it gives the girls to keep going forward, and hopefully they don't give up on this Manoyama Festival easily. So I look forward to the next episode, so until then, I'll see you guys in my next video, so I'm Alpha Zero people, have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time, alright? Peace out. Bye-bye. Toot-toot-toot!